what's going on guys thanks for joining us for another video here we are exactly three weeks away from deer season so i figured i'd come out and do some more shooting i've been shooting a lot lately actually just trying to get everything dialed in um, for this upcoming deer season i got a uh, white tail tag in my pocket for my home state of nebraska so hopefully we can uh, make it happen this year didn't have as much luck as i would have liked to last year but that's all right, we're gonna be hard after it here in three weeks, so. I'm gonna start off with a couple quick blank bales. So I'm still using this Stan Perfex release, this back tension release. I actually really like it. Yeah, I think it's improved my shot. Um, there's still some things I need to work on with it, like pulling through my shot. Just need to get more repetitions through it and get everything dialed in before the, before the opening day. So I am the first one to admit that I am far from the best archer in the world. I've been practicing a lot these last three weeks and should have been practicing more this summer. Just didn't get out as much as I would have liked to. Next year, gonna be a whole different ball game. I plan to shoot at least twice a week and I'd like to shoot three or four if I can. But for now, I'm just practicing as much as I can trying to improve daily. There's a truck driving by and I heard him coming. So I really didn't want to have that stress of trying to shoot and hit a target while he's driving by. It's all about safety. So I feel pretty dumb. I've been shooting out here since I was 15 or 16 years old, just the local archery range. And they have these yardage plate markers. 40, 20, 30, and they have a 50 back there. But they've had these holes in them. And I have never once used them as an arrow holder until today. Used to always just take my arrows and throw them on the ground. More you know, I guess. Learn something new every day. All right, it's time to move back to 60. And this is where I always struggle. I group up pretty good at 40 and in, but get back to 60 and it kind of freaks my mind out a little bit and I don't pull through as well. So I'm trying to work through that every day. Shoot a couple reps through here and do what I can to get past it. 60 right on the dot. Hi. Just a tick high, quite a lot high actually. 
and one way left. So I was aiming down there, and that's where I hit. Well, I was not shooting well at 60 at all. I was having a tough time pulling through it. So I switched game plans and I've decided just to come up here, get five foot from the target and just blank bail for the rest of the night. I'm gonna do about 30 blank bails, get more comfortable with things, and then I'll come back out tomorrow and probably start off with another 30 blank bails and go from there and see how I'm feeling, so. Anyway, I'm not going to bore you with that. I appreciate everybody watching the video. If you haven't, please subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for tuning in. Mm -hmm.